Welcome to episode five of Joe and Marie do an LP. I guess I don't really have a whole lot to say starting out. <laughs> well, it is like the fifth one we've done and you know, they are like over an hour long. How much are you going to say since we're not very talkative people? Well, you know, for the first three episodes, well, first four episodes, I had something to say at the intro. And now you did this time, too. We're just going to argue about it. Yeah, we're just going to talk about not having something to talk about. Yeah. <laughs> much to do about nothing at all. I think it's much ado. <sighs> Sure. Go with that. Yes, I know. I mangled Shakespeare. I'm, I'm a terrible person and uneducated and all that. You're ineducated. Yeah. Of course, I always put my phone on this, in my pocket on the side that the dog is leaning against. Never fails. Spoiled, rotten dog. Mm hmm If we didn't have her on the couch next to us, she'd be sitting here pacing back and forth, waiting for us to invite her up on the couch. Good morning to you. I should warn you, we're about to pass the point of no return. I trust you're not having any second thoughts. No second thoughts here. Although well, that probably means uh, that I won't have a chance to go back and do a whole lot of side quests. Nope. It's the end of the road for you. It's only chapter four. Whoever thought of tapping into the meteor's power was a genius. Can you even go near that thing? They harvest fragments found nearby. Pieces that broke off when the meteor fell. Almost fell, I should say. But the Archeon caught it. And he's still there, holding the thing up. Guess he never misses leg day. Or any day, for that matter. I guess the game's His ending. unceasing toil and the meteor's might form the tenets of worship for the locals of Disguise. Makes you turn. wonder what it's like yeah. down there at his feet. Yeah, because, um, yeah. Looks like he slowed down for me. I just, I love that threat. So you know, it's hot where we're end. going. Will the camera fare all right? As long as I avoid open flames, it should be okay. I think. We don't have a spare if it breaks. Leave it in the car? Oh no, I'm taking it. Not every day you get up close and personal with the Archean. I kick myself if I miss the photo op. Spoken like a true photographer. As they say, better to try and fail than never to try at all. Look at you. Well, they say that. Not me. Well, you just do what you gotta. I guess since uh, Yana hey, Iggy, slows down... Can your glasses take the heat? Well, I don't see why they shouldn't. Even if they couldn't, he'd still be all right. Yeah, Iggy's eyes ain't that bad. Oh, really? Yeah, my vision is possible without corrective lenses. Then why not take them off sometimes? Well, uh, you don't get it, huh? Ignis likes his world to be crystal clear. Indeed. I've never been one for ambiguity. Ah, I think I'm getting the picture now. Anyway, I was, as I was trying to say before they so rudely interrupted me, if, uh... Hey, Ignis. If Noctis... How's it feel being away from the wheel? Positively frightening. What are you saying? That I'm no stranger to His Highness's driving habits. Appreciate the confidence. Read a book. It'll take your mind off it. I'd rather keep my eyes on the road for now, thank you. I guess nothing can take your mind off Knox. We're here. Better not be a setup. Have I given you reason to doubt me? You don't really inspire confidence. Yeah, not very straightforward. Hello, it's me. Be so kind as to open up. Wow, that worked? I may not look like much, but I do have some influence. 
Aren't you glad we came together? Your audience with Divinity lies ahead. You're leaving? I drop you at the Archean's open door. And with that, bid you farewell. Love the fact that his hair matches the color of the car. I've met some weirdos. I hope we never meet that one again. Whoa! A little harsh there. Slow down! Think. There's no risk. Guy really knew his stuff about nursery rhymes. Yeah, nothing creepy about that. I love how my controller's just freaking out. Yeah. Because you've got an expensive muscle car and you're going down a dirt road. You're supposed to be a little bit nicer to the car. Ooh, it's kind of cool. Really. So we keep going this way. Then we'll find out what the there Empire's are up to. There are car who are cringing. <laughs> there was no risk to the car. So you say. Yeah. These ruins. Yes, these ruins. Switch weapons before I start using the one that's going to drain my health. Although I would like to see what that other one looks like. Expect to find a royal tomb here. Would be a shame not to grab that power, eh, Highness? Let's grab it and go. Huh. Probably the easiest weapon Lotus has ever gotten. Pretty cool sword. Oh my god. Whose sword does it remind you of? King Arthur? No. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure which one, but it looks, it's pretty nifty though. Ah, excuse me, so oh, sorry. This is not boring, at all. Here we go again! This one's huge! Get away! Quickly! Tell me something. But what? Not! Hey. You okay? Well, thank heavens you're safe. Is there a way back up? No, but there's a path. Gonna see where it leads. You two try to get down. Very well. We'll look for a way. Be careful now. You two. What? We're going where? Don't rush off on yes. your own, huh? Don't get left behind. Wise guy. I guess I should probably make a fire spell. What? I love the fact that Final Fantasy really tries to mix things up so you can really explore each character's individuality and their strengths and weaknesses. So that they... So far that mechanism, I think they started doing that in... Uh, well, they really did it in Final Fantasy fourteen where they really started switching up the characters. One group would go this way, and then they'd switch it up and... 14 is the MMO. Is it the MMO? So it's 13. That had lightning in it. Yeah. Okay. So with lightning and that group, uh, they really did a great job on switching up the characters 
so that in different scenarios you had different characters paired up so that you could try out the strengths and weaknesses of each one instead of getting comfortable with one pattern throughout the entire game. Did that just sound like Arwen? Sorry, I was reading the uh, spells. Oh good. I'm glad you listened to me. <laughs> so glad my comments are valid. Let's see. Stop caps. Elemental lightning is not yellow, the color is pink. <laughs> there we go. Got a couple of uh, should probably equip this one. We'll put a spell on. Yeah, we'll get the Blizzard as well. Let's not ruffle their feathers anymore. Um, try shutting your beak. Just offering sound advice. Yeah, like a parrot in my ear. Except for those types, those are good ones. Hold up on fire again. Damn. Hey, over here. Yay, I'm gonna proceed. No room for error here. <laughs> no time to chill either. Make it quick. This to be over. Trimmer's down. Hang on. My head. Again. Of all the times. Let's hurry the hell across. Knocked. You doing all right? now. Hey! Titan! What's the big idea? Save it. Get to solid ground first. <laughs> Faster! Calm down. I'm going as fast as I can. Trying to grab him. Yep. Here 
Walking. And I'm sick of your endless whining. Calm the hell down. Get off my back. Are you a man of royal blood, or aren't you? <laughs> of course I am. I couldn't forget it <coughs> if I tried. What about it? I ain't saying that you've forgotten, but you gotta know something. You're not the only one who's having a tough time. We're all on edge. We Amicidia are the king's sworn shields. Guard the king with our lives. That's the way it's always been. I've embraced my duty. And I take pride in it. When you can't focus, I focus for you. It's my job, so let me do it, all right? All right. company it's about to get even hotter in here this explains why I have all these uh, elements you think something that's mechanical would just malfunction under this kind of heat eh, you know heat shielding and whatnot these are magitech <sighs> we finally made it I know well, let's start them off the night nice freezing attack. I'm here! What the hell is it you want? Quit screwing with my head! You gotta be kidding me. Are you alright? 
This ain't gonna work. We gotta run. Best advice you've given all day. Well, I can't have you dying here. Come on.
Hey, we all still here? Yes. Yep, still here. If a little battered. Does this mean it's over? What? What is it now? What is he doing? He's winding up! For the big one! Myself. Izunia! Arden Izunia! Imperial Chancellor Izunia! At your service, and more importantly, to your aid! I guarantee your safe passage. Though you're always welcome to take your chances down there. Buried among the rubble, is it? Dying here is not an option. I know. You killed a titan. They killed Titan. Not a Titan. They didn't really kill him. He just. We well, can't really kill a Titan. Not, not a Titan. Titan. You know, I'm never going to let that go. Besides, Atlas shouldn't ever be considered THE Titan. Ever. I mean, if you wanted to pick A Titan to be THE Titan, you'd have to go with Kronos. No. He's not THE Titan. He is Titan. That's his name. Yeah, I know, honey. I'm still saying, it should. if they're going to pick a Titan, why did they choose Atlas? to be the titan. And now you know how annoying your puns can be. No such thing. Yeah, I like that one. 